everybody this is the victoria decorator model here at heritage landing you can see you've got a brick paver driveway and tile roof there are options between barrel and flat tiles all the homes here include impact glass doors and windows so you're not going to have to worry about hurricane shutters they're also wi-fi certified so they come with the ring doorbell the smart door locks the smart thermostats and your smart garage door openers, all of which can be um, operated with your phone. Okay, let's go inside and take a look. So here we are at the entryway. The Victoria is a great floor plan if you don't need a lot of bedrooms. It's 1,850 square feet, two bedrooms and a study. And here is our gorgeous study. This is great if you work from home or I've also seen people set this up as a bedroom. But it comes with the glass French doors and here in the entryway, you've got this gorgeous tray ceiling. Really nice. And over here is our guest bedroom. You can see you've got a lot of nice space here. All the homes here include um, window blinds on your windows. Here's your guest bedroom, it, or sorry, your guest bathroom. It includes the step down bathroom. And there's a nice little linen closet tucked away back there. Here's your laundry room. It comes with the, the cabinets and the GE washer and dryer, your wash sink. All that's included. And here is your two, bed, uh, two car side load garage. So it comes with the epoxy coated floor. includes a lot of great features standard in your base price. So it's going to include the eight foot doors, the built-in appliances that we're about to see, all the crown molding that we see here. So here's your gorgeous kitchen. It comes with white shaker cabinet standard. If you're familiar with this floor plan from any of our other communities, we've lowered this breakfast bar. So it's a more updated look. It's very popular. We have the built-in appliances. There's your pantry. Here's a nice look at this great open concept. So this floor plan is great for entertaining. It's also awesome if you like tray ceilings because they're everywhere. A lot of architectural interest in this home. So we have this high top table set up here. I've also seen people set up this area as a little reading nook or if you like to do games or cards puzzles, then that's a great place for it too. One thing that a lot of homeowners point out is that the master has a side entry to the door. I know a lot of people don't want the door to the master to be viewed from the living room. So that's great here. You got a private little nook. And a great feature of this floor plan is that wall that's slanted right there. So depending on your home site, you can be laying in bed, watching the TV there, and to the side, you can get a gorgeous view. It also has direct access out to the lanai that we'll take a look at in just a second. But this kind of gives you an idea of just how long this room is. There's lots of space. I've seen people set up um, little makeup counters here where that plant is. You've got his and hers closets. Here's hers, nice and big. That, um, that cut out there is for our home run. That's where all of your smart home technology terminates. And then here's his closet, it goes back. So it's actually much deeper than you would think. And here's your master bath. This is a great master bath because you've got his and hers vanities. And you've got a nice step down shower. They have to replace the glass right here. So nice and long, lots of space. And a separate water closet in here. So last but not least, we're gonna take a look at the lanai area, um, which is one of the favorite features of this home. 
This is the greatest lanai that we have, the largest. So it's about 330 square feet. So you can see how wide it is from there to there. You can also add the summer kitchen, which would go right there. Um, this home doesn't have a private pool. You can add a private pool. Almost all of our home sites here will support a private pool. But you can see here how much space you have. And then whether or not you put a private pool, there is an extra half bath out here, which is great. So it's a dedicated half bath. All of my pool owners, they really love this feature. So the grandkids aren't having to go inside to use the restroom. But again, this is the Victoria at Heritage Landing. If you'd like to learn more about the current availability of this or any other home here at Heritage Landing, please give me a call and we can further discuss.